Sam, offensively, you guys obviously scored a bunch of points the first half. Did you feel you left some things on the field the second half? Yeah, most definitely. We left a couple plays out that we should have made, you know, minor errors, mental errors. But, you know, we always got next week, you know, to come back and fix it. Sam, can you, uh, early in the third quarter, the, the fumble punt uh, that you guys ended up recovering, was that you that got blocked into the returner? Yeah, okay. so, so I was a gunner, so I was running down there. He threw out the fair catch late, but uh, Bryce, like, we were taught, like, if, the, if somebody's blocking in front of the returner, is to push him into the returner, and which was smart heads-up play by Bryce, but, you know, he hit me into him. So I really don't even know how that's supposed to go. I've never seen that before, so it was something new for me. You were holding up, though, right? You were coming. Yeah, I was coming to cover it. Right? Yeah. And then, did you see, like, did the ball hit? The returner? I mean, no, I hit the, one of their players blocking. And so that's why they said it was our ball. Just a yeah. Frustration level for this team? I mean, um, you guys were obviously much better this week than last week, but still frustrated? Where are you guys in that term? Yeah, I mean, it, you know, we're kind of frustrated because, you know, we went out there and fought, you know, against the number, what, seven, whatever, you know, went out and fought game that we should have won, honestly. But we're not there in fight, you know, we didn't get the outcome that we wanted, so you know the level is kinda high. How would you evaluate the offensive performance as a whole this week, especially in comparison to the last week being down? Uh much better. You know, we fought, we did our jobs, we you know we did our one eleven. But you know, we still, you know, kinda, you know, made some mistakes that we you know shouldn't have made. So Sam, does it surprise you at all? I guess, you know, you, you kind of break games down into halves sometimes. The first half is a complete shootout, and then the second half becomes kind of a game of possessions and field goals. The fact that it changed so much from one half to the other, surprising at all? Or? Uh, I wouldn't necessarily say surprising, but that's just like how, that's just how football goes sometimes, you know. Energy's high first half of the game, then you come out, you know, kind of a dull start. And that's kind of what we did, because we should have, a couple of drives we could have went down and scored, but we didn't. So it's just part of football, part of the game. How do you guys bounce back? You just put our heads down and go back to work, watch the film, see what we did wrong, fix it, and then go back to work. The, um, the, when you guys got that fumbled punt, and then you guys get held to the field goal. Coach kind of called that maybe the most disappointing drive of the season. Uh, would you agree? I mean, the uh, most disappointing possession that you guys didn't get? More I mean, I wouldn't necessarily say disappointed. I mean, he believes in us, you know, to go for it and make that play, you know. She could have got a PI, honestly, yeah. but we didn't. So, I mean, I'm 100% behind him. If he, may, he believed in us to go out there and execute, I'm behind him for calling it. Okay, anything else for Sam? Do you have any thoughts on the P.I.? I feel like it was a P.I. The D.B. didn't play the ball at all. He just played the receiver, so it should have been a P.I., especially at the college level, it should have been a P.I.